Okay. Um, we're up to Yud Gimel. Today's stop is Yudal. We're up to Yud Gimel at the at the bottom. Yud Gimel at the bottom of the page. It says, Bahayavoma Niknis Bibia. That the Yavoma is Nikna Bibia. She's kind herself with what? With Chalitza or, or Misas Haba. Now, says the Gemara, Vayavoma Niknis Bibia. Bibia mi nolon. How do you know? In other words, we know Anisha, Kikachishishu Ubala. We know Anisha is acquired with Bia. How do you know Yavoma is acquired with Bia? Says the Gemara, Yavama Yavai Aleha, Ulukacha Loy Isha. So written this way, the Yavama will come on to her. And then that Bia that comes on to her, she is now taken as an Isha. So again, Yavama Yavai Aleha, Ulukacha Loy, that Bia that she has with her, now that makes it, and the key word being there is Le Isha. The Emma Lakula Milsa, the key word being Yavama, Yavai. Says the the Emel Akula Milsa Keisha. Once you tell me Keisha, let's say in every which way, like an Isha, maybe it, even the Inyan Kesef and Shtar. That not not just be but Kesef and Shtar. Yavama Yavale Ule Kachaloi Le Isha, and she'll be like an Isha. So therefore, I feel Kesef and Shtar should be kind of the Yavama. Says more like Salkadaita to Tanya. Yochal, I might think you hate Kesef the Shtar Goyim Rimba. I might think Kesef and Shtar would con- complete the Kenyan of the Yavama, Kiderach Shehad Bia Gaimeris Ba, just as Bia completes the, completes the Kenyan, Hamad Loimar, it says, the Yibma. Yavama Yavay Le, the Yibma. What does the Yibma mean? Lashna Bia, Bia Gaimeris Ba, Vain Kesef Vishtar Gaimer Ba. So we have a Pasik, the Pasik says, the Yibma, to go ahead, Dafka Kesef, Dafka Bia, and not Kesef Vishtar. Says the Gemara, how can you say that? The aim in my be yibma de bal karcha mi yabim that it can be saw in the sechta yivamis you can yabim a yivama against her will. So if I need the yibma to teach me that against the will, I don't have it have it extra to teach me that only bia is goymerispa. And if she's taking leisha, I might say shtar and kesev as well. In Cain, if that's the case that the yibma teaches me only one din lemakra ve yibim just say ve yibim and therefore she be taken against her will. My v'yibma, why the extra? Hey, shema mina tati, you know two dinim. One, that only b is gameres, because it says v'yibma, it says it twice, guys. It says b, it's mashma, yivama yava yalecha, v'yibma. So you have it saying twice, yivama yava leha once, v'yibma a second time. Says Rashi, why does it say it two times? To tell you it's ma'akiv. Tell me that what, it's ma'akiv, if you don't go ahead, what, and complete it. And I, you'll ask the second one, you need it. To teach me a din of Valkarcha, since it could have said Vayibim to teach me that din, it says Vayibma to teach me that din, Shmamina to dinim, a Valkarcha, and straightens that only B is Goimer and not Kesavishtar, despite the fact that she's called Isha. Bichalitza, she knows she's calling herself Bichalitza Minolon, and this is a re- repetition of a Gemara we had Dalid regarding how do you know that, that a Chalitza doesn't go out, how do you know a doesn't go out with Chalitza, how do you know a uh, 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 Anisha, how she doesn't go out with with the chalitza, and how do you know uh, Yavama doesn't go out with get? In other words, we both know what Anisha is is matavali they get, and we both know Yavama is matavali the chalitza. How do you know each one doesn't work by the other? Minal in the chesiv it says v'nikra shmoy b'yisrael, his name will be called b'yisrael beis chalutz hanaal. Look at Rashi, guys. B'yisrael beis chalutz. Look the way Rashi is reading. He's leaving, leaving out the word hanaal, and he's saying b'yisrael beis chalutz. Hachimashma, be Yisrael ruuya lehevi lebayis. A Yisrael is ready to bring her into a house when mishe chalitza after the act of chalitza. So, guys, beautiful base chalitz hanal. Be Yisrael base chalitz. Rashi took out the word now and he focused on be Yisrael. When is she? When can Yisrael bias take her into a bias? Is chalitz after chalitza? So we know that chalitza matters. Says the more kibun shechalitz ba now. Chutzul Chol Yisrael, read the Gemara. You tell me, be Yisrael, base Cholitz. That the act of Chalitza, matters of Yisrael. I need the Yisrael for something else. Hi Yisrael, lahachi udasa. Ami boil in the chidetani. Rabbi Yishmuel, Rabbi Yishmuel, Rabbi Yishmuel, by Yehuda, be Yisrael. Be bezdin shel Yisrael. Loy be bezdin. Let's change the gersa. The loy be bezdin shel gerim, and not be be bezdin of gerim. In other words. The, the gears of Avabi Kechavim is very, very schwer. Why would you think that you can go to a Bezdan of a guy to do Yivim? So the, the Bach changes the gears to Geirim. So this is a Chiddush. 
Gerim are full-fledged Jews. But when it comes to Yibum, I need Yisrael. I need someone who was Yisrael for his whole life. So Fred the Gemara, how could you tell me that be Yisrael based scholars? Tells me after Chalitza, she's mutter to Yisrael. I need Yisrael to teach me only a Bezdin of Yisrael and not a Bezdin of Gerim. And for the Gemara, I'll tell you how you know that. The Trey Yisrael Ksivi, it says Yisrael twice in the parsha. It says, be Yisrael based scholars. And it says at the end of the parsha, that my, my Yavami does not want to be making Meshem Yisrael. He doesn't want to keep his brother's continuity. That we spoke at the whole concept of Gilgul Neshama. So therefore, you have a second Yisrael to teach me the din of Gerim, and we have a Yisrael to teach me that what? Beis Chalitz now, once there's a Chalitza, be Yisrael biased. The Yisrael could go into the house of anyone. It's a very Gishmak. Kasha, I still need Yisrael for another thing, a third thing. It says the Gemara of Bakatimi Boyle Lechedetanya, Om Rab Yehuda Pamachas, Hayinu Yoishim Lechne Rab Tarfin, who was sitting in front of Rab Tarfin doing a Chalitza, Ubasa Yavama Lachloitz, but Om Rolon, who he told us, who was sitting there, not the Dayanim, anyone who was sitting there, Anu Kulchem, Vamru Chalitz Anal, Chalitz Anal. Anyone who's there should say, Chalitz Anal, Chalitz Anal. So I need that lot, Yisrael, Pashas, to tell me, all of Yisrael should go ahead and say, so how can I have an extra to teach me that uh, that uh, for your Yavama, says the Gemara, that Yavama is only matters completely, says the Gemara, if that's what you need it for, that everyone present in the Bezdin has to say, right? We call this guy, we're calling out this guy. This guy's doing a Chalitza. You, th- you think about it, guys, outside for a second. In in when y- Yibum is a huge chiddush, we're mattering at Ashes Ach, which is Nisakaris, a sister in law's Nisakaris. The Mokoim Yibum, there's no Issa. It's a tremendous chiddush the Torah is saying. You're not taking advantage of that. You're, in other words, the Torah mattered for a huge reason. We spoke out that this person is going to be alive through the child born through this Yibum. It's a Gilgul Neshama. His Mamash Neshama is going to go in there. We spoke about that. And now you're taking it, you're throwing it away. You're doing Chalitza. We, we're Mavayish, this guy. We call him out in Bezdin. Beitz, Chalitza, now. Everyone calls him out. We're all calling him out. We're calling him out for what he did. So guess what? We could, you'll be called this, right? You'll be called the guy who didn't go ahead and do the job that should have been done. So very good. You have you have two Yisrael's. Want to teach me a bezin of Geir of Yitzgerim is no good only Yisrael. We have the other Yisrael, be Yisrael based chalitz. When Yisrael does chalitza, when he when she receives chalitza, then be Yisrael chalitz. She's able a bit biased. She's able to be in the house of anybody. So that's how we know. So we know two things: chalitza and not bia. We learned that chalitza and, and not bia and not bia, and we're learning at what this din of. We learned that chalitz and not bia because uh, uh, the yid, it should have said v'yibeim. It says v'yibma. So we learned that two things: one bal karcha and two only bia. And we're learning chalitza and oh, and chalitza that she goes out the chalitza and she's matter to to what to any person from the pasuk of the Yisrael based chalitz. Very gishmak. Says the Gemara Vaita. Uve misas hayavam. She's now muta to the misas hayavam now. It's fascinating, fellas, if you think about the Svarach Yitzchina, if you think about the outside Svar, it's a fascinating thing. In other words, here's what you would say. I need a Pasuk to tell me that when the Yavam dies, she's Muta. Because what would have I have said? I would have said, well, she was married. She's not an Eishas Ish yet, because she's an Eishas Ish, she's not a Yavam yet. So, if the before the Yavam had a chance to do Yibam, he dies, she goes free. What would you have thought? You would have thought she stays in that state. Right? You would have thought she, she stays in that state. Which state? She 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 was a Zika to this person. She never received Chalitza. She never considered a Heta. So the Gemara's Kasha is the Chayra. It should be no different than what, what we learned yesterday that the Misa of the husband, Matisa. We had the Gemara yesterday night, that the Misa of the, we, we needed a, a Pasuk to tell me 
that when a husband dies, that the woman now what is free. Right? We, we, we yesterday we learned that we learned it out from two psukim. We learned it out from penyamas b'mulchama. You'll go to war and someone else will take her. Or we learned it out what from that the pasuk in in, in Gittin says like yesterday's parsha it repeats it twice that either she'll have gerishin or he'll die and he'll go to another man. So you see she's permitted to another man. So let's get this straight, fellas. An Aishis Ish, we needed a Pasuk to tell me that even after her husband dies, she need, you need a Pasuk to tell her she's free. So now we're taking the same formula and saying Yavim as well, we need a Pasuk to say she's free. Now, obvious question is, why can't you learn out from Aishis Ish? And that's what the Gemara is about to do. And that's what the Gemara is about to do. Guys, it's a politic thing. We take it for granted that if a man dies, she's muta, because that's the halacha. But you needed a pasik to tell me she's muta, because once you change the status of the woman, she went from penuya to neishes ish. She's now a different a different mehus of abria. She's an eishes ish. She's an eishes ish, and that. So we know a get takes her out, but but masha masha misa and misa takes her out. Maybe she remains in that status. You needed a pasik to tell me. So now we're going to apply the same thing by by Yibo. Says the Gemara. Where are, where are we, Lazy? Well, on Yudal and Amid Aleph, uh, you see the Taisvis Amakra? Yes. Go up a few lines, there's two dots. Okay, I got it. Thank you. Okay, Uva Mises Hayavam, Minalan. How do you know that she goes free to Mises Hayavam? Kalvachaim, it's a Kalvachaim. Uma Ashes Ish, Shehi Bechenek. An Ashes Ish, if she's Mizana, is in Chuy Bechenek. Mises Abal Matirasa. Nonetheless, the death of the husband takes her out of that status that she has a severe Mrs. Bezdin, Yevama, if she would marry to the Shuk, Shehu Belav, it's only a laugh for Yevama to marry to the Shuk. There's no Mrs. Bezdin. Like Kol Shekane, that she is weaker, that the Mrs. of the Baal should go ahead and matter. Good? Eishasish. Ma'ala Eishasish is more l'chomer, because she has chenek. The Baal, the death of the Baal Matis, the Yavama, which is only Balav, calls Shekane that the death of the Baal, the Ab should matter. For the Gemara, you'll ask, Mala Eishis Ish Shekane Yotze Beget. Eishis Ish goes out with Get. Toyme Bezu Shein Yotze Beget. Right? Why are you going to say, an Eishis Ish has an other way out? Mashain Kini Yavama, which doesn't have an other way out. For the Gemara, that's not true. Hanami Yotze Bechalitza, she does have an other way out. So lechayra, you don't have a kal v'chaimer. Ella, let's go in this direction. Mal eishes ish shekain oisra matira, the one that asses her matis her, right? Who matis her, right? So one second. This is about. So lechayra, we have a good kal v'chaimer. Lechayra, we have a kal v'chaimer. Again, kal v'chaimer. Madach Anesha Sishis Bechenek goes free with Mrs. Abal. Certainly Yevama will go free. I list that my my Isha goes out what with Get. She goes out with Chalitza, right? I so therefore so therefore you you do have a good Kalvachaima right now. So now you want a Pirchan the Kalvachaima? Here's your Pirchan the Kalvachaima. Elamala Aisha Sish Shekane Oisra Matira. The one that asked is the one that matted. Who asked her? Her husband. Who's the one that matters her? Her husband. Now the half mean is Yavama, it's the dead husband that asks her, but the one that matters her is the Yavam. So Amaramashi, Hanami Oisra Matira. Yavam Oisra, the reason she can't marry is because there's a Yavam, Yavam Sharila. So it's not like you thought it's the dead husband that asks it. This is this is big, big Yavam is Taira. So therefore, right now, the Khaira, right now, you, you have a good Kabakhaimer. You know, it's you ask the kasha, and every pircha that you had, we we offset it. Says the Gemara. Okay, so now we've already established, guys. So now, if I wake you up in the middle of the night, how do you know your vama goes free with Mrs. Abal? It's a, you learn it out from a kalvachaimer. Madach and ishes ish bechay bechenek goes free, so too she does, and there's no question on the kalvachaimer. Says the Gemara. With a ishes ish yotze bechalitza mi kalvachaimer, let an ishes ish go out free with chalitza kalvachaimer. We ask this. Earlier in the Masechta, 
my Yavama Shaini Yaitsa beget. Yaitsa Bechalitza, a Yavama that can't go out get because Bechalitza, so you see Chalitza stronger. Zusha Yaitsa beget in Dinshi Yaitsa Bechalitza. I'm a cross, safe for Krisis, safe for Karsa being double after Karsa. The only thing that can feel nations ish, as the Pazik says, is, is a safe for Krisis. But Mashain came out a Yavama. Fred, more the other way, with a Yavama Yaitsa beget me Kavachaimer, let the Yavama go out with the get from a Kavachaimer. Uma Esha says Shain Yaitsa Bechalitza, Yaitsa beget. Zusha Yaitsa Bechalitza in a Dinshi Yaitsa beget. Amakra, so the Pasik says, Kocha Yasela Ish, so you should do a Shalibna Espace Achiv, so you should do to the person that does not want to go ahead what and build the base Achiv. So now, guys, outside, I have a Kalvachimer. I have a Kalvachimer. Madach Esha Sish, which doesn't go out with Chalitza, goes out with Get, uh, a Yavama that goes out with Chalitza, Enoi Din, that she should go out with Get, and it's a good Kalvachimer. And for the Gemara, you know why? It's, you know why? It's not to do with Kalvachimer, it's a Mir. It says kocha azoi daf zayin. This is the way it has to be, and if it's not this way, it doesn't work. It doesn't work. In other words, kocha. This is the way it has to be. It has to be through chalitza and nothing else. Now it's mashma over here from this gemara that if you have a kal and a miot that says this is the way it has to be, you don't learn the kal The gemara is going to ask. I'm going to give you gemara outside, guys, so you understand it. The gemara is going to ask the following. I'll show you a place. Where you have a, I'll show you a place where you have a miut and a kavachaymer, and you still say the kavachaymer. I have a miut, and, okay, and you're still going to say the kavachaymer. What's that place? It's the two seirim. It's this two seirim by Yom Kippur. That the goyrul, if you would say uh, this one is a chatas, and you'd have a goyrul, and it would, this one is a, a, a zazel, it doesn't work. In other words. It has to be the chatas is al yedei the goyro. There has to be the chatas. So if you would go ahead and call a chatas, and then the goyro would come out that this one that you call chatas is azazel, it will be lazazel. Your kriya shame doesn't mean a hill of beans. It has to be. Now, why does it have to be? Because it says goyro and it says chuka. It says goyro and it says chuka. What does chuka mean? Anything in the parsha of, of Yom Kippur has to be azoy. It has to be like that because it's a chuk. It's a chayk. Now, if I have, I'm going to have a kal v'choymer, and that kal v'choymer now is going to go ahead and say that kriya shame should work, and then you need a limit to tell me not. So we have a raya that what, that even though there's a kacha, even though there's a chayk, you do say kal v'choymer. So kasha, why by chalitza, where it's a kal v'choymer, you should be able to go out with a get by a yavam, kal v'choymer from gitten, even though you have a kacha, you still should say the kal v'choymer. From Yom Kippur. Let's see it inside. Says the Gemara. The Kocha Ikuva. Fred the Gemara. V'chol heicha the Ikki Ikuva. Le darshi kal v'chaymer. Anytime you have an Ikuv, you're not going to darshi in kal v'chaymer. V'ho Yom Kippur. D'chsiv. By Yom Kippur it says Gairol. V'chuka. It says the Lashon of Gairol. V'chuka. Meaning, you have to do a Gairol. V'tanya. The Pasuk says. V'osohu chatas. Meaning, the goyrul oisachatas, the ain't a shame oisachatas. So I need a pusik to tell me, guys, that what? That you can't call chatas b'shem. Fred Gemara Shiachal, because I have a kal v'chaymer. Baloidinhu, that you should be able to. Uma b'makoin, shloi kiddush ha-goyrul, kiddush ha-shem. If a woman's sky of birds, goyrul doesn't work on the birds, but kriyas ha-shem does. If you you need birds, you're a zav, guys. You need a, a chatas and an oila. You're a ledes. You're going to say, this one is a chatas and this one's an oila. If you did a gairil, it wouldn't work. But kriya sashem does work. So, ma b'makan, in a place. Right. Ma b'makan, right? Ma, uh, um, I'm, I'm going to get lost in a second, one second. Uma b'makom shloi kiddush ha'goyrul. By let's say the two birds, by the zav, for example, kiddush hashem, makom she kiddush ha'goyrul ain't a din she kiddush hashem. So I have a kal v'chaimer, guys. Ma b'makom that goyrul doesn't work. Kiddush hashem does work. In a place that goyrul does work, ain't a din that kiddush hashem should work. Now, what should you answer me, fellas? Look at me. You should say chuka, guys. What do you say? Was hakmei at shayna gonna kal v'chaimer? You said the word chayk. Chayk samiyat. That's the. In other words, azoy tav zayin. You need a goyrul, correct? But you, the Gemara doesn't answer that. The Gemara answers the oisahu chatos. 
The Gemara answers, you needed a Pusik to tell me. The Gairo makes it a Chata. So why do you see? Even in a place where you have a, a, an Ikov, a Pusik that tells me this is the way it has to be, if I have a Kalvach Oimer, I need a Pusik to tell me it can't be this way. So let's 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 go let's let's do the, let's go do the paper trail. Look at me, everyone. Look at me. Let's do the paper trail. I have a kalvach oimer that a a yavama should be permitted al yaday get. What's my kalvach oimer? Madach a isha eshes ish, which doesn't go from chalitza, but get does work. Where chalitza does work by yavama, ain't I din that. That that get should work. What does the Gemara answer? The Gemara answers kacha. No kacha. It's like that sign. You need chalitza. So mashma because I have a, a, a kacha a miut, I don't say a kal b'chayma. Fred the Gemara in that one second, not so fast. I'm going to give you a place where you have a kal b'chayma and you have a miut, and you still needed a pasuk to tell me, meaning the miut didn't stop it. Where is that? Yom Kippur. By Yom Kippur, we're saying the following. That the only way this these two goats can be a chatas and, and an azazel is al the gairo. Why is that? You would say because it says chayk, but it's not true. It's because it says vaso chatas. Now, question: Why do I need the pasuk vaso chatas? By Yom Kippur, it says chayk. What does chayk mean? Azoi daf sign. This is the way it has to be, and so therefore I would say this is the way it has to be. You don't say that. Why? Because I have a kalvachayma to tell me you don't say that. What's the kalvachayma? Madach in a place where goyrul doesn't work, like by zov, by 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 the kinim, it doesn't work. But kriyas hashem does work in a place where goyrul does work. Ain't I din that kriyas hashem should work? And now we come along. We don't say it's a chayik. We say you have a pasuk. Fred the Gemara, great kasha. Fred the Gemara, so good. It says kacha. It's still not enough. I have a kalvachayim there. You need a pasuk to tell me you don't dash the kalvachayim to tell me that a, a, a yavama should not be divorced all your day again. <laughs> not the easiest cheshbon. How are we doing? Okay, no good. No good. One more time. Good, good. It, it, Baruch Hashem. Okay, let's so, so, so now, guys, we're holding. We need a pasuk now by chalitza. To tell me why she's not divorced by a get. We need by Yavama. What okay? Says the Gemara. Let's fear ice. I'm gonna do, do it again from your kippah. I'm gonna sign from your kippah again. One second. I have a pasta telling me that this this goat can only be through through a through a gyro. I would have said that what? Even through Kriya Sashem, it could be a chatas, the, the goat. But like then who? Here's a Kalachaymer. Uma b'makam shleik kiddush ha-goyrol. By the, by the kinim, by the birds. The goyrol doesn't work. Kiddush Hashem, but Kiddush Hashem does work. Makam shleik kiddush ha-goyrol. By what? By the, by uh, Yom Kippur. Ain't it in shleik kiddush Hashem? Hamad loim ava so chatas. Ha-goyrol is a chatas, ve'en Hashem is a chatas. Right, the time of the miyata kra, and we see what the whole reason that you can't go ahead and use call kriyas hashem is because we have a miyat from the pasuk of what vaso chatas halav hachi without the miyat darshin and kal v'chaymer achav gav the siv bechuka even though it says chayk that this is the way it has to be if I have a kal v'chaymer this is not the way it has to be if I have a kal v'chaymer I would say what that you 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 right you need a pasuk. So over here we have a kavuchaimer, madach and isha that doesn't go with chalitza goes with get, a yavam that goes with chalitza in the yetz with get, and you can't tell me it says kacha because you see you still dash in the kavuchaimer even when you have a miut. Says Mara amakra la love lo liyavama. The pasuk says by guys listen to this we're going in this way, la the chas of la sefer krisus only for an ashes ish do you write a get not for yavama. La. Notice, originally you were learning the lima from the Yavama itself. Now we're coming in through Gittin. The chas of La. By a, an Isha, you go ahead and, it, and, and, and you write a get, but not by a Yavama. The Ema La Lishma. I obviously tell you, with most famous lima in the the Gittin, you need La to tell me Lishma. So how can you tell me La, 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 Yavama? So, it says it twice. It says it twice. 
I still need the second one. If a guy has two wives by the same name, he can't divorce them at the same time with the same get. We had this at the end of Gittin. You need two separate Gittin. La, for her, and not L'chaveirata. So now I need one for Lishma, one for L'chaveirata, so I don't have one extra to tell me that Dafka uh, is divorced by a get, and not a Yavama. So that's right. Ella, Omakra, you're right. We're leaving that. Ella, Lashon Charata. The Pasuk says in the Parsha of Yib- Yibum, it says Na'al, right? She takes, the, there's two Pesukim, the Pasuk. And she takes the na'ol me'al ragloi. We have another passage. So we have na'oloi and we have na'al. Good? So now, what are we going to darshan? Na'al, na'al in, midiach minuloi. The only thing that will matter li'evoma is a shoe and not a get. Fred Gemara v'hayi na'al lo'hach yudasa. Can na'al teach me that dafka al yudei Talitza is she is she, is she sent free and not with a get? I mean, boy, little Chintanya na aloy his shoe ain't the Ella na aloy. Now she'll call them in aloy. How do you know you can use somebody else's shoe? Come let me now. So I need now for that. And now me call Mokoin. In Cain, if it's only coming to teach me that, ma come let me na aloy. No la aloy aloy. Prat le gadol shein yachal alech boy. If it's too big, prat le cotton shein chayva. It's too small. Amid beis. Ragloi, Pratlem is Sulem Shainlay Akov, it doesn't have a heel. So it says the Gemara, in Cain, Kra, in Cain, Nichlev, Kra, Naal, Maha Naal, what's the extra hay? Shmami no Tarti, from the extra hay, we hear that what? That it can be somebody else's shoe. We also hear that what? That you can be divorced through what? Through a, through, you can't be divorced with a get. You're divorced only through Chalitza. That's the final thing. Okay, so it's 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 a long daf, it's, it's involved. Okay, we're in the beginning of a whole new sugi now, guys. This is the sugi of Avadim. The sugi of Avadim is the thing it has in common. Is the common? It's it's a it has it's a, it has the concept of Kenyan. Derech, derech hakdama. Okay, you'll have to excuse my handwriting, but here it is. There are, in the Torah, there are three parshias of Gittin. One in Parshas Bahar, one in Mishpatim, and one in Re'e. The one in Bahar is speaking about Meicher Atzmai, a Jew who sells himself to, a, to into bondage. He, Meicher Atzmai sells himself. There are two possibilities. He either sells himself to a guy. And the pasuk there is v'chisasid yadger v'toishav imach u'mach achiche ima he gets too poor the nimcha lager toishav imach so that's a person who's so poor he says it's a yikur chafei mem zayin you have an ex pasuk moicher atzmo li yisrael he sells himself to a yid and that says ki yamach achicha the nimchar kisach k'toishav yia imach so in in the parsha of moicher atzmo we have two parshias one to a yid and one to a guy. The next parsha is the one that we really, really know. That's Machru Bezdin, where a person is sold because he stole and he doesn't have what to pay back. And Bezdin's stealing them. And that parsha, that parsha is Kisikna Evidivri, Sheishanim Yavoid Ubashvi Yetzay. And additionally, in Parsha's Re'e, which is also speaking about what? Machru Bezdin. It says, Ki Yimachalacha if your brother is sold to you, Ayavri, Ayavriya, very important, the Hekish. Between a male and a female. So this parsha is also speaking about Machru Bezdin. And a second Pasik, this is the Pasik that says of Hanaka that Machru Bezdin, you have to give him gifts when he goes free. It should not be difficult in your eyes to send him away from you. 
Ki Mishnah Schas Socher of the Chashe Shanim. This is underlined for a reason. Finally, you have the Parsha of Amevriya, the Parsha of Amevriya, Im Ro Beini Adoneha, Asher Lo Yada. He didn't do Kedushin, the Hefta, and he. Okay, so we're going to learn out. The Gemara is going to say that there's a din of Kesef, and the Gemara is going to learn out from here. In the Parsha of Machru Bezdin, when he sold himself to a guy, it says, Im Oid Rabois Shanim Lepien. You're going to deduct from the depreciation of Kesef Miknasai of the Kesef of his Kenyan. So you see, he was acquired Mephorish, he was acquired with Kesef. So that's the, the Hakdama is there are basically th uh, three types of Avadim. Actually, there's four. We'll, we'll, we'll introduce to a fourth. There's three types of Avadim. One is the Mecheratzmai, that we have two types, one to a Goy, one to a Yid. Machru Bezdin is sold by Bezdin. We have Ame Evriya, whose father sells her to uh, in, in, in bondage. And finally, we have the Pasha of Nirza. The Nirza is the one who is Machru Bezdin who decides he's so happy in that status, he will go ahead and be stay until Yavu. Says the Mishnah. Ebed Evri, Nikna Bekesef, Ubishtar, Vikoina Atzmoy. Okay, and Ebed Evri is acquired with Kesef and Shtar. Today's Shir is going to focus on the Kenyan of Kesef. Ubishtar, the Kaina Atzmai Bishanim, he's kind of himself with six years. Ubi Yavel, and if the Yavel comes in within the six years, he'll acquire himself. Ubi growing Kesef, and he can buy his way out. He sold for six hundred dollars for six years. If he's able to get together a hundred dollars per year, whatever his amount is, you make the deduction four years, two hundred dollars. He'll get two years, four hundred dollars, whatever it is. Yisera love Amevriya more than the um, the Evidivri is the Amevriya. The Amevriya is the girl who sold as as, as a katana, and she, the purpose is for the master to marry her, and she goes free not only with Shanim, not only with Yaivo, not only with going Kesef, but she also goes free with what the Simonim. If she reaches, if she brings two Simonim of Nairis, she goes free. Hanirza, the one Machru Bezdin who decided he wants to stay in bondage. Nikna Biritsia, he's acquired Biritsia, the Koines Atzma be Yoival of Mises Odin, and he coined himself a Yoival of Mises Odin. Okay, I'm going to put this chart up. I'm going to keep it over here because we're going to be referring to it as we go along. But you know what I did? I messed up the chart. I have to get it back. That should get it back. Says the Gemara, Ebed Ivri Nikna Bekesef Minalan Amakra Mikesef Miknasoi Melamich Nikna Bekesef. Okay, look at the chart, guys. Here it is. This Pasek, Mikesef Miknasoi. There it is. But what is that referring to? That's referring limited to a Moicher Atzmai and limited to a Moicher Atzmai to a guy. That's the only Pasek. So right now, if you bring this Pasik, the only one of the many that we decided is Meicher Atzmai and only to a guy. Fred the Gemara, Ashkan Evidivri Anim Cholavit Kechavim. You find an Evidivri that's sold to a guy. Hail the Chol Kinyani B'Kesef. Since all is Kinyanim of B'Kesef. Rashi says, all Kinyanim of a guy B'Kesef. There's no Pasha Meshicha. Taisa says that Rebbein Otam, all his Kinyanim of a guy is with, uh, of a Evid is with Kesef. It doesn't work with Shtar. Nimcha Yisrael Minalon. How do you know this, guys? Look at the chart. How do you know Meicher Asmali Yisrael? This is the second thing. How do you know that if a Jew sells himself to another Jew, how do you know he goes out with Kesef? How do you know that he's kind of with Kesef? Amakra, it says Vehefta. Now, where does it say Vehefta, guys? It says Vehefta over here. It says by Omevriya. So how in the world are you going to apply this to an Eved Ivri that sells to a guy, that sells to a Jew? You tell me that post is speaking about Amevriya. It says the Gemara Malamed, Shimagares Pidyana Biyaitza. It teaches us that the Amevriya, she goes ahead and deducts whatever the amount he has left, and she goes free. Ashkin Amevriya, Hoyl Mikdash of a Kesef, the Kanye of a Kesef. It makes sense. The Amevriya that you acquire a Kesef, she could re reacquire, you can, she, you, she, you can make Kadash of a Kesef, you can you acquire with Kesef. Ebed Ivri Minalan. How do you know an Ebed Ivri? Amakra, Ki Machalacha, Chicha, Ivri O Evriya. Okay, guys, let's go to the chart. You needed a source 
for we want to make a, a relationship between the Jew and the and the Jewess. Here you got it, right over here, guys, right over here. Look at it. Pashas Rei. Ki machalacha chicha the ivri oyavriya. So we have a heckish between the two. You've established from the hefta that the ivriya is kind of a kesef. Now you've established that the ivri is also kind of a kesef. But which ivri, guys? Which ivri is kind of a kesef? Look at the chart. The one that machru bezdin. What's our, what's our question? We want to know this one. How do you know the meicher asmoi is kind of right with kesef? Good, you're telling me that Ivriya is kind of a kesef. And you also have proven that Machru Bezdin is kind of a kesef. Of course, that's a hekish. But you didn't answer our question. Our question is, Meicher Atzmai to a Yid. How do you know it's kind of a question? Says the Gemara, back inside. Ashkin Machru Bezdin, Hoyo Venim Chabal Karchai. Machru Bezdin, since he was sold against his will, what? He can be, he can be, go ahead, what? And he could be acquired with kesef. Meicher Atzmai Nalan. How do you Meicher Atzmai to a Jew? How do you know he's acquired with kesef? On that thing, Mari answers the following. Let's go. Let's see it over here, guys. Why does it say? Look at the chart. It says over here, Ki chichav nimcha, ki It says the word sacher over here, correct? Why does it say in this parsha by Hanaka? And this parsha is speaking about Machru Bezdin. We already established, guys, look, Machru Bezdin, we already established to its Ekish to Amevriya that he's acquired with Keset. It says over here, sacher. So just like Machru Bezdin through a Hekish. Is this, is acquired with what kesef because there's sachir, so too the machar atzmai to a yid is kesachir is also with kesef. So you have two sources: the machar to a guy is mekesef mcnasai. The machar to what to here is we don't know yet. We have to learn it from machru bezdin. When you machru bezdin, you learn it from ivriya. Ivri is kind of kesef because it says vehefta ivri. Now it says sachir by machru bezdin. It says sachir by machar atzmai. Ma machru bezdin is acquired with kesef, so to what machru atzmai is acquired with kesef. Back in the Gemara. Yalav sacha sacha. Hanichel man the amad yalav sacha sacha. That's good according to man the amad that learns sacha sacha. Right. El man the lo yalav sacha sacha mayikle meimar. So we have a source for machru atzmai from sacha sacha, but we're going to see in a second that lachar it's machloikas tanoyim. Amakra. So there we have this pasuk v'chisasig. Okay, very gishmak, guys. This is vayikra chafei mem zayin. This is mem. What does the vav do over here? This vav attaches to this. It creates the parsha a jurisdiction in a, 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 a juxtaposition. So we've established mekesef mignasoi that this guy's with kesef. It says vav and it connects to here. So just like he's with kesef, so to he's with kesef. You don't need any sophisticated Gezeri Shavis. You have a simple Vav HaKibur to connect the Inyanim. So just like Moicha Atzmai Legoi, because it says Kesef Gdasai, so too it says, if you Sasig, it's going back on Moicha Yisrael, also would be the Kesef. Moicha Val Inyan Mishoin, the later on to the Inyan Mishoin, the Yirman El Yim Vitachton, we'll learn the upper one from the lower one. Right? Just like the lower one, Kesef Gdasai, so to the upper one. Now, so you said that there's a Machleikas of 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 sacha sacha, we want to know who that is. Okay, so guys, so just quickly, let's let's review what we just saw. Let's go through the chart quickly. Moicher we have we have from Mekesef Gnasai. We want to know Machru Bezdin. Machru Bezdin, we we know why because it says by a Jewess, it says Behefta. So obviously she's what she's going ahead and detracting from the Kesef Kesef uh, of the sale. She was kind of a Kesef. I that's Evriya. We have a Hekish by Machru Bezdin. Ivriya Ivriya. So just like Ivriya is Bekesef, so to Makru Bezdin is Bekesef. Good. Says the Gemara, but what about this? What about Meicher Atzmai, Le Yisrael? Two reasons. If you're in Sacher Sacher, it says by Makru Bezdin Sacher, it says by Meicher Atzmai Sacher. Just like Makru Bezdin we've established through the Hekish. It's right through Kesef, so to this is with Kesef. Uh, I, you don't learn Sacher Sacher, so then you'd have the Vav over here, this Vav in the Chi, going again and connecting to Yom Chachicha, and we've established here Kesef Meknasai, so thus, you go ahead and be able to say the whole thing would work. Sometimes a piece of paper can do you a tremendous amount of good, guys. Without this piece of paper, but you jumble words. With the piece of paper, hopefully a little bit of understanding. Okay, let's let's see. Now we're going to go sacha sacha, and then we'll call it quits. Says the Gemara following: Uman tanu lo yalev sacha sacha. Hi tanu ditanya. Okay, outside guys. There's a bunch of halachas by Meicher Bezdin that are stated by Meicher Bezdin. So, for example, we just saw one Hanukkah. 
the idea of giving gifts when it goes free. That's stated by Machu Bezdin. The ability to give over a, a, a shifr kananis, to go ahead and father more avodim for you, that's dafka machru bezdin. Good? If you learn sacha sachir, then every halacha that's stated by machru bezdin will apply to machru atzmai. If you don't, then obviously you're not learning sacha sachir. That's what the Gemara is going to say. It says the Gemara, I'm following. Matan loyal sacha sacha, hai tanahu, the tanya. Hamachru atzmai nimchul sheish, summon he sold for six years. He can even make a condition to be sold for 10 years, 11 years, he can make a condition. Only six years. Another halacha. The one who decides he likes the, the situation being with his wife, with his his, his, his master, and, and the shifu kananis could stay. Cannot stay. There's no presence by a machratzmai. So obviously, fellas, this person is not learning the Gezei Rishava of Sacha Sacha, as, as, as we saw, right? We saw in this chart that if these halachas all applied over here, right, and it says the word Sacha over here, and it says the word Sacha over here, so whatever halacha is applied here should apply here. So obviously, when they don't, it must be that you're not learning Sacha Sacha. It must be that you're not what? It must be that you're not learning sacha sacha, and therefore what? However, if you hold all the halachas do apply, then you're learning sacha sacha. Says the Gemara, and Rabbi Eliezer changed the gears. Not Rabbi Laza, Rabbi Eliezer Oimer. Ze v'ze ein nimcha el Both the why they both both only six. Even the machru bez atzmai. Ze v'ze nirza. Even the machru atzmai. Ze ze manikim lai. Even the machru atzmai. Ze ze maru l'maisla shuf kananis. Even the machru atzmai. My lab hakanifli, the Tanakamu says that there's there, there are different halachis, la yalov sacha sacha, does not learn at sacha sacha. So Amraf to view me, Mishmay the Bayah know the Kulyam Yalov Sacha Sacha, Bahaka Bahai Kokamifli. Right. And here they're arguing the Pasik. Right. In other words, according to the Tanakama guys, and this is the really the Hakadama for tomorrow's daf, more, more than for today's is the following. If you're gonna learn that Moichar A does not have Shifra Kananis, not six years, and so on and so forth, and you're learning Sacha Sachir, by each one of those halachas, you must have a Mia to tell me not like that. The Tanaka, in other words, if I'm learning Sacha Sacher, the halachas should be universally the same. It must be, if you're saying they're not universally the same, when they should be, you must have a Pasik to tell me that it's not. And Bez Hashem tomorrow will pick it up there and see what those Pesachim are, because we're going to have to go through each and every one of them. Thank you all for listening, and I'm sorry for the late start. It's uh, I can't I have no schedule here. It's just, it is what it is.